Hey, what we're going to do today is download a new browser onto our PLC 400 or 600 tablet. The reason we're doing this is because Windows no longer supports Internet Explorer. So if you would like to use the Internet, you need to update the browser. Um, I am on my desktop computer right now. Uh, you can use your laptop. You're going to need a USB drive. And then also when you get to the tablet, you need to have Internet. So you need to turn your Wi-Fi on, connect it or use a hotspot. I'm going to go ahead and download Chrome right now. It's a pretty fast process. Once it's downloaded, I'm going to go into the file explorer. I'm going to go to downloads. Uh, my USB drive is already ready to go. So I'm going to go ahead and drag and drop that into my drive. I'm going to replace that because I already have one in that file. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and save it without its properties. That's totally fine. You'll have no problem there. We're going to go ahead and eject that. And then we're going to go ahead and move over to the PLC 400 or 600 tablet. Um, I have my tablet hooked up right now to a mouse. Um, so you'll see a mouse moving around. And what we're going to do is we're going to go to our file explorer. Once we've put the USB drive in the tablet, we're going to go ahead and open that up. And we're going to go to the D drive. And then we're going to go ahead and uh, double click or double tap with your finger. Or you can long press uh, with your finger and it will start the download. Uh, it should download and install within less than a minute if you have good internet connection. Um, it'll walk you through that process. And then once it's ready to go, it will actually open Google and ask you to save it as the main browser for your tablet. Uh, that is basically the entire setup. 